Now sound is a disturbance. Now to prove this, what I've done is I've arranged these dominoes equidistant from each other, which I will call it as particles of the medium. And this here is a balloon, which is going to act like the eardrum. Now I'm only going to disturb the first particle and let us see if the disturbance reaches the eardrum. Now what you have seen is I disturb the particle and each particle disturbed the next particle. Now the particles have not moved from their place. They are in the same place, but the energy has been transferred to the eardrum. So are you ready to spot? This is a race between solid, liquid, and gaseous medium. Now see what I've done. This blue and purple dominoes, I place them close to each other, and this is going to be my solid medium. Because in solid medium, particles are closer to each other. Now coming to the red dominoes, this red dominoes, I place them at a slightly greater distance. And this is going to be the liquid medium. Now coming to the yellow dominoes, of course you have guessed by now, the yellow dominoes are going to be my gaseous medium because here the particles are far away from each other. Now we are going to create a disturbance at the same time instant. Let us see who is the fastest. So let me begin the disturbance and I'm going to start this particular disturbance at the same time instant. So now it is clear the disturbance travels fastest in the solid medium. So where will sound travel faster? Of course, the solid medium. So sound is fastest in the solid medium, slightly slower in the liquid medium, and much slower in the gaseous medium. So this was an experiment to show you that in solid, liquid, and gases, sound travels fastest in the solid medium.